back with more big cities and we're on our way to the big city. We had an interesting horde night last night. It wasn't too bad. It was actually quite fun. And this baby is holding up really nicely. We actually had every zombie going exactly where we wanted to. We had a minor incident where zombies kind of started bashing away on a wall, but we figured out why that was and fixed that very quickly uh, because one of the floorboards actually was missing or floor blocks. Now, we're gonna head over to this town here towards this direction, but Mm, will we get the airdrop first? Uh, no, we're not gonna get this now. We're going to head over here to our trader and we're going to try to do some local quests. Hope that he's gonna give us quests for some local um, zombie clearing or whatnot. And then we're going to hopefully get the missing ingredient, either a bottle of acid or find the wheel straight up to finish the bicycle. So for this case, I brought the bicycle parts with me so that if we actually happen to find a wheel directly, we just can build it. If we're gonna find the bottle of acid, we're gonna be able to build the wheel straight away we have all the uh, resources for that on us as well so we are perfectly set up we're perfectly prepared everything is hunky dory so let's go get ourselves a bicycle and level up so i just chanced my arm like looking in the kitchen over there in this house but uh, nothing useful just a little bit of food i think it's the kitchens you usually find the acid in i could be wrong but it's either kitchens like under the sink or in the in the garages of the houses uh, with the cars because they usually have a couple of crates in there which could be either the gas station crates or the working tool stiffy crates or the hidden stash crates oh look at that very nice there could be a dog in here yeah it looks like there's definitely there's a dog house so let's be careful right here. Oh yeah, I can see you, I can see you. I want to see if I can get into the kitchens of each of the, oh, nice. Let's have a little sneakeroo. Oh, we have a big boy sitting right here. No dog so far. It would be great to get into the kit. Oh, look at that. Nice. Okay. Okay, that was really glitchy, but at least we didn't wake up the big biker boy over there. And no dog. Let's actually destroy that because we don't want that to be um, making a lot of noise for us either. Oh, there's a big Bertha in here. There we go. Nice. Right in the face. Beautiful. Let's kneel down again. Let's be quiet. Let's see if we can find anything in here, like a crate or anything. No, but a lot of stone. This is a lot of good resources. Look at that. We have a nice crate here, which potentially could have exactly what we're looking for. She have to be quiet. Oh, look at that. I can see the crate hiding right here. There's no dog, actually. We're very lucky so far. But nonetheless, I'm kind of <laughs> just... Cr oh, oh, oh. Okay, that sounds like a snake. But luckily, it's on the other side, so it's not coming through here. And, okay, we just... Oh, we got an engine. Well, look at that. And, oh, we have some food. That is amazing. We're completely over-incorporated. Do we have a point to spend? No, we don't, because we definitely want to get some more points. Oh, a destroyed workbench. Oh, look at that. Now that we actually found one, <laughs> crafted one, we found one. That is amazing, though. Yeah, we're going to bring that to the trader and sell it. Absolutely. That is fantastical. I'm loving this. So we get a little bit of resources here as well. We're going to be so over-encumbered, but we're going to um, get some points into... Oh, wow, that is a lot. That is a lot of meat, and I think there's another one coming here. Oh, there's another few. Oh, my balls. Wow, that was a lot of snakes, but we got a lot of meat. We only got bit once. We got 60 meat. We're completely over incorporated, but we need some food as well, so we might as well make a little bit of room. Very nice. There's another chest here. There's a lot of... Oh, wow! Holy balls on a cracker. Oh! Oh! Ho, 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 ho. That was exciting. Wow, that was very busy in there. Very nice. I love that they were hiding up the end. Oh, I see a crate. 
Guys, I see a grate that could have a wheel in it or something more exciting. That's not the one I'm talking about, but this one here was not that exciting. But look what we got up there. A garage storage crate. Oh, ammunition. Okay, that's not bad, but what I really, really want is this. Wheelie, wheelie, wheelie. Oh, ha, ha, look at that. Oh, my balls. We have so many of those now. We can actually sell them, which is great. And this is all a normal loot strength, like holy balls. I can't believe there was two in there. Oh, can we wear that or do we have something better? Well, we kind of have something better. But we're getting a bit of a movement penalty. So what I might do is switch them around so that way we don't get the movement penalty. And we're going to scrap this instead put that into the new arm equip very nice we have one more backpack actually here and yeah just some random bandages bandages nothing to write home about okay we have one more barn area which i'm assuming is gonna be full of spiders or something i don't know okay spiders are not a vanilla thing oh engines nice what do we oh yeah look at oh we have this guy he's a fast one yeah, I knew it. Come on. Oh, he's... A oh, run, 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 run. Oh, I'm, ne I'm kneeling down. Why am I kneeling down? Oh, he died of bleed, did he? Whew, very lucky. He was a feral. A feral as well. That is not good. That could have, that could have bitten, bitten us severely in the ass. Okay, let's see what we have here. Let's get um, Chelsea as well. Very nice, right in the goober. There we go, beautiful. And we're gonna we're gonna take a purse as well. She was holding on for it for dear life, but it didn't really help her at all. Um, yeah, sure, why not? Let's see what we have in that working tool, Stiffy. This better be worth it. We're gonna have to walk away tonight. Today in this episode was a bicycle, or I don't know what we're gonna do. Oh my balls! Look at that. That is awesome. Okay, I like it. And we get some steel as well. This was worth it all along. That is amazing. And we have these guys as well. I think we can use the wrench on them. For some iron. And an engine. Oh, that is amazing. And another engine. Yes. That is beautiful. We are full now. There is absolutely no stopping us, though. We're going to have a look and see what else we can find here. Oh, look at that. Another engine. Are you kidding me? This POI is amazing. We are so full, though. We have no more room for anything. I hope we can make it to the trader. We're picking up a lot of goodies, but I want to sell some stuff at the trader. And then we have a little bit more room. And then I think what I'm going to do is put a chest by um, the house where we have the chest. And we'll see where the next quest is. Because if that trader gives us a quest that's kind of here in this town that would be really, really awesome, then we can just make a chest by the trader, dump everything in, and then bring stuff with us once we have the bike. And here we are, we're at the trader. Let's see what we can sell. We have no problem with food actually now for a while because we have so much meat as well and cornmeal, which is absolutely great for the little filler. I just ate my last canned food. Oh, we did loot this? Yes, we did. All right, okay, so why don't you, first of all, tell me if you have a job nearby. There's no way you don't. Clear zombies 300, yes, that's what we want, absolutely. Let's sell everything we can. And there we go. We can sell three of those. There we go. I'm gonna sell the lockpicks as well for now. I really want to sell the engines for a little bit of cash and make some room, but I don't think I should. So this might sound a little weird. Yes, uh, this is the second half of the video, which was recorded actually two days after the first half. The first half was recorded on Monday that you just seen. And right now I had recorded the second half and I realized my Windows sneaky update this morning disassociated my microphone again from OBS. So I, ha I have no sound. So basically what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut it all together. I'm going to uh, put like a little montage together of the rest of the episode. Um, all we really had happening and it's different between the previous part and this part is that we added some quality of life mods. We added mega stacks, which allows us to stack stackable items up to like 30,000 or something like that. 
we have better vehicles, which uh, makes the base speed a little bit faster. And once we have vehicles, also the storage a little bit bigger. And then we also installed a Keynes modlet for 24 hour always open traders, which means we can do quests at night. Oh, and we also installed lockable slots, which means the little number you see above in the inventory is slots that we can lock up so they don't, when you say, hey, put everything in a chest or merge everything into a chest, it leaves the slots you locked alone, which is a very handy feature if you have items in a chest and also in the inventory, but you don't want to merge them. Anyway, sorry about the mess. I really apologize. I hope you can enjoy the rest of the episode as a little montage. <laughs>